Hello everyone, Green Gemini here, back with your next episode of City Skylines Springwood. Now, as the title suggests, we are going to go in here and we are going to put a stadium in over in uh, the Elk area, Elk Heights. Okay, you know, we had talked about this before and this is what we're going to do today. Um, we've got the subway access, we have a really nice view out here onto the water. Uh, of where it can go so that's what we're gonna do uh, and we're gonna make it look real nice and everything too I, I want it to to look great um, it took me a minute to figure out where <laughs> these were and I actually completely forgot about all of these unique buildings so next episode we're gonna go into the city and we're gonna look at some of these unique buildings that we have in here see what might fit for certain areas of the city um, like a high interest tower, that would be something that would be great for downtown, right? Um, it would actually be something really good to put in uh, this district right here with the IT cluster. Um, and then we have the science center. We have, there's just so many things in here that we could put in that I completely forgot about. Ooh, an observation tower. Um, so we'll work on that in the next episode, kind of getting our skyline a little bit bigger, right? Um, as we're going through today in this episode, we'll kind of start plopping down some more uh, zoning and stuff like that, you know, as the uh, demand creeps up and our population starts to creep up too. Maybe by the end of this episode, we'll hit 46,000. Doubtful, but may maybe hopeful. We'll see. Um, but as I was going through and I was looking at these... Could do the education uh, football stadium, but eh, not going to, only because I want to save that for the university itself. So we are going to go into our unique buildings uh, under football, which football is the, it's technically the, um, the in not the English, but it's the other version of football. It's soccer, right? That's, that's what Americans call it. Americans call it soccer because we have football as something else. Um, and I want to use this uh, Juventus Stadium. Uh, visitor capacity is 750. I think it's 750 in all of these. It looks like it, yeah. Um, but this is the one that I want to use. Now, I don't want to put it right next to the road because that's going to create a lot of noise and stuff for all of this area. So, we're going to take it back and we're going to put it probably right about, I don't know, maybe right about here. Let's see what I can do with these plain streets here. Um, I'm going to take this in. Let's go into about here. Let's take this down to about there. Actually, if I go here, like that, I don't think I can fit it in there itself, no. But I can put it right here. And then... I want to leave a space in between. Actually, let's leave three spaces in between the road and that. Okay, so that'll get built up here. Does that look okay? I think it does. I do. I think it does. Um, a lot of these trees and stuff will be gone. <laughs> a lot of them will not be in here. Um, but I want to do this. Hooks directly up to that. Which we can continue it on that way for right now. And then I think we'll have... We want to make sure there's three spaces in between here, okay? Because I want to have a walking path that goes around this too. Because I don't know what it is about walking paths, but I really like them in this series. <laughs> just, I don't know, someone had mentioned that I needed to have them, and now I have them, so, uh, let's, that is not good. No, 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 I don't like that at all. Uh, let's take this park path, and then we're gonna take this, and we're gonna go up with it. So we're gonna go up one, two, three, four, five. There you go, so that flattens it out, that's what I want to see. Let's go with the move it tool and we're going to take this node 
in this node. Nope, I'm not going to copy it. I'm going to align to object height here. Perfect. Actually, it probably should align to the actual road itself. No, it's okay. It's all right. All right, so then we'll take that out a little bit. We'll take it out to, let's say, here. And we should be able to go... Well, let's stop it there for now. Because then I want this page down. To go here. And then to there. But I want... I want it to be pretty much all the same height here. So this and this need to align to that height. Perfect. Which should be about the same height as that almost is. So that will then go down to there like that. So is that, is that higher? It is higher. So we need that. Oh, it is. Okay, okay. So align to object height here. Oh. And that's, okay, that's at a different height. Interesting. Oh, it is at a different height. Okay. So we need to fix that then. So that, that. And this all actually need to align to that height there. So that is actually going to go up then. Like that. And then that will continue on down. Okay. We've got, wow, look at that. We've got a ton of people coming in here already. Now, people are parking along the street and everything. We don't want that. Uh, we want to create a bunch of parking lots in here. So, where are those at? Those are in here. And then I have, I think the 4x4 four four ones are going to be the best option. So, if I go 1, 2, 3, let's do that. Take this one, move it over. And then that's going to allow me to put a street in between here. Perfect. So then I can actually move this and put it to that side. This can be put to that side. That can be put to that side. That can be put to this side. Okay. Nice. And then we can go in and we'll just plop all of these down here. Let's see if that goes in between. So if I go like that and that and this, then I can get a road in between here as well. So we'll block these off. We'll move that one over. We'll move this one over. I mean, I could put parking spaces at the end too, but I'd rather have some plain streets in here so that we can have because then what we can do is we can go into here we can do this and then we can get um what kind of trees do i want to put in here these maybe yeah because we can use the prop line tool we can go into here and we can add some trees in might have to add a couple in individually but no big deal. Yeah. See, we can do something like that. Okay. Uh, so we've got parking here. I think we want to go ahead and extend the parking out this way a little. Mm, so that's going to need to go here and there. This will go there to there. Go back to this. Oops, 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 oops. Well, I guess I could have just moved it instead, but whatever. Um, this road technically doesn't need to be here. I just used that to um, be able to tell where that needed to go. 
And then I think that can go ahead and go away too. So we've got a big round circle here of parking for that. Beautiful. Uh, metro station, I think works totally fine where it's at. You know, people have to walk a little bit, but that's no big deal. Um, we want to make sure that... I'm okay with people driving in and around here. Um, kind of makes the trip go a little bit longer for them. Um, we want to go in and we want to say no parking. Uh, I thought I could select the whole thing, but I guess not. So we want no parking throughout here at all, right? I want to make sure that they're utilizing... Oh God, this is annoying. Come on, there's got to be a way... Okay, it's doing it for that at least. <laughs> Come on. Um, we want to make sure that they're utilizing the parking lots and not the streets themselves. So we'll do that. I'm hearing a lot of leveling up going on back here, which is pretty awesome. And I think that's from adding the stadium in here. That's great. Um, let's say no parking in here as well as here. Okay, cool. All right. Um, I feel like we need more in here. There needs to be so much more in here. Let's see. Is there some kind of hotel or something like that that can be put in here? There's Meteor Park. There's Plaza of the Dead. A statue of Shopping. A statue of Wealth. Ooh. That would actually be really good right here. Okay. We'll put the Statue of Wealth in there. That actually fit perfectly in there, too. Uh, let's see. Posh Mall. Transport Tower. A friendly Neighborhood Park. That would actually look really nice right on the outside of here. And it looks like we can even... Hook into it with a different pathway, too. Ken. So I'm thinking we take this path and we go... Down like that. Curve it up. Down. And go to... Come on. Like right, no, not right there. Not right there. Get rid of that. Um, there we go. That's what I want. So we want to do that, and then we'll move it, and then we'll bring it in slightly like that. Okay. So that'll give people, you know, somewhere to kind of walk through. Um, we'll give, let's say, we'll take this. Swinging around to here, hook up to that part, give people kind of a walk through through there. Um, let's see, we've got a little park here, we've got that there, we have parking. Let's go ahead and fill in our trees in here. So I want these to go all the way through. Top line tool. Hopefully, we get this lined up pretty good. Yes, perfect. Get all of that in here. Come on. You know, the only bad thing about this is all the freaking seagulls that are around. That's okay. I'm just going to have to deal with them. Wow, look at all the people that are out in here. Love it. I mean, these people, you know, they want something to do. You know, they want to be entertained. They need stuff. Look at that. That is awesome. Let's see. Um, this will also help with tourism too. So, next match is 3-8-2040. Eh, not too far away, actually. We're already at 27. Um, okay. 
So there's that, and then I'm thinking... Mm, Spring District, where are my districts at? Ooh. In Spring District, do we have commercial? I have a little bit of commercial right here. I'm thinking we need to have commercial right here too, and it needs to be hotels. Granted, that's not going to be the best for those that are living in here, but <laughs> it's... Um, there's nothing wrong with that. What are you complaining about? Not enough customers. Okay, so we'll wait on that then. Um, let's see. 3,000 income. That, that, that. Okay. Uh, let's go ahead and fill in a little bit of this area back here with some residential buildings. Uh, let's see. Let's go with that. These. This. Don't want anything along here. Let's go that. All of that. And that. Okay, so that can all be residential. That one can be too. I think we'll put like a small park or something like that in here. Or we can do like a park or something like that in here as well. And then we'll just have residential throughout here. I'm not entirely sure if I want to do commercial or what I want to do with that area. Do commercial here. Got a lot of open land out here. But I'm not I'm not entirely sure that we don't want to keep it that way. Or we could put some offices in here. Yeah, actually, let's do that. Let's go ahead and take Plain Street and we'll cut it down through here. And then we'll add in some office buildings here. And then we'll also go with office buildings here. Office buildings in this whole area here. And then add more offices here. And there. Actually, we'll take the offices off of that section. And then we'll leave the rest of that open. Yeah. Yeah, I like that. I'm good with that. Okay. Oh. And then that'll help promote and create some uh, some travel as well. Now, when it comes to tourism, that's where you're going to get, like, parks, plazas, um, let's see, some other parks. There's a basketball court and a tennis court, which I don't really need in here. Could put a clock tower in over here. <laughs> No, no, that's not going to be... It's not too unique for this area. No. Kind of leave it like it is. I do like the sports complex. That actually turned out really nice. And it didn't take that long for us to do either. It really didn't. Alright, we've got... Oh, we have no water over here. Get that filled in. And of course, they're also building up to where there's no electricity either. Right, let's do a temporary electricity connection. Yeah put a little in there, but we can go ahead and take that out. Get rid of that for now. Okay. That way we've got electricity coming in. Once this builds up enough over here to where it can connect over, then I oh, can take that down. But I think, honestly, that's it. That's all I'm going to do with this today. I'm, I'm just going to put this in here. And then the next episode, that's when we'll look at putting in, well, so like over here in Transit Central, how we built some stuff up over here, we can put the, um, the 
transport tower, like that could go over here, you know, like that can go like right here. Um, you know, just little things like that, that we can add in to the city that I want to start looking at. Um, and then that's going to be it. So questions, comments, concerns, put it in the comment section down below. Uh, let me know what you think of the city so far. I think it's going pretty good. We've got a nice big sprawl happening. Uh, population is at 40,000 and growing very quickly, which I think is great. Uh, and then, yeah. So lots more to come with this series. We have so much that we haven't even touched yet. But let me know what you might want to see in the city in the comments below as well. That is all I have for you guys today. Thank you so much for watching, everyone, and I'll see you next time.